The view I'm expressing is a view that classically has been termed liberalism. In the modern day and age, the word liberal has come to mean almost the opposite of what it used to mean. If you look at the dictionary, liberal means of and pertaining to freedom. If you look at behavior today, liberal means of and pertaining to freedom with other people's money. I am a liberal in the original sense, in the sense in which John Stuart Mill was a liberal, in the sense of which his statement was a statement of liberalism. And the liberal view that the justification for government action is to prevent coercion and to promote voluntary cooperation among responsible individuals leads to a very short list of basic functions which government should undertake. They are, first of all, to prevent one man from coercing another, the internal police function. They are, second, providing for external defense. These two are really part of the same, to prevent coercion, to prevent coercion from within, to prevent coercion from without. And beyond this, to promote voluntary cooperation among people by defining the terms under which we're going to cooperate together and by adjudicating disputes. If we are going to cooperate with one another in a voluntary way, we have to know what the rules of this game we're playing are. What are the terms? What rights do I have? What rights do you have? 